I was working full time. I had no real idea of how to invest in anything in terms of an asset. Uh, I was working up to 50 to 60 hours a week uh, and there was no real insight or future I could see where that would not stop occurring to the point where if I was to retire it would be at 70 with probably superannuation I think it's average of 150 and that you know unless I plan on dying in two years that would not probably uh, give me the lifestyle I wanted and seeing my parents work do the same thing that was not the result I wanted for myself so that's basically um, you know, where I was and what I was after. Tim was Tim is very relatable just because he is not just the you know the big guy that wants to sell you on you know property. He actually um, he was just a common guy with a common goal and he was able to communicate to that to the people the best way he could which was you know, through his actions and through his history. And because of that, it allowed me to really um, look up to him, more of a mentor and more of a kind of like a person of high wisdom. And because of that, it gave me a lot of you know, trust. It built a lot of trust between uh, the process itself and the client manager as well. It just made the, com um, the experience way more comfortable and uh, easygoing. Definitely learned a lot more about property investment, a lot about asset building, and because of just seeing the energy that the client managers and the process had, um, itself, it's given me a lot of, um, I guess, it's influenced me in a way to actually learn more myself, read the books, the relevant books, you know, research uh, in different asset development ways of doing that, so I can, you know, take more responsibility my, uh, in building my financial future. It's hard to tell, but because I had no structure before, I had no idea of what I was building, and with the new knowledge that I've built now over time, meeting Tim, meeting the client managers, learning about financial freedom, learning about building assets, it's looking pretty damn bright. So, you know, nothing's ain't gonna stop me if uh, if the market goes bust. I know I have the people to talk to, the mentors and the um, client managers to help me guide me through that scenario. Absolutely. I mean, there's no other. If I look back in the people that I was hanging out with, the people that I was being influenced by, they themselves did not have any idea of how to build any wealth. You look at how their you know, their results, and the results did not really correlate with anything I wanted for myself. So, if I would be able to give them any insight into how to, you know, get more of a financial response, um, financial stability, financial wealth would be the first people I would, uh, recommend, just because. They actually do have the knowledge, they do have the insights and the structure and just the, the relationship building skills allowing you to uh, just feel comfortable in building wealth.